Hello friend, this is Rupesh and you are watching CPNet's video on map versus unordered map in C++. I have seen lots of people using map and unordered map but without knowing that okay what is the actual reason or what data structure is actually used underneath these two data structures. So let's start with the basic differences. So this is the difference table. We have map here in this column and this is going to be unordered map. Okay. And these are the points we should consider when you choose map over another map or another map over map. So first of all is ordering like how your data is stored. We all know both works on a key value pair. That's why people get confused for these two and they start using one over another or they don't know what they're doing. Okay. But as there is a map, they, they think like, okay, I can map this key with this value. Okay. So if this is key, then this can be a value. So if you store this key and this value in both map and another map, there won't be any difference. It will still store these values, but the ordering for map is increasing order. Meaning if you do, I mean, if you insert stuff like this, T W O two and three T H R E E. So if this is your key and this is obviously a value and if you insert in map and you iterate over that map, then you will get first this guy, then this guy, then this guy. Does it matter in what order did you inserted this? If you will insert this first, then this and then this and you will iterate over map, you will still get this first. I mean this and this pair first, this and this pair second and this and this pair third. So there is a order involved which is increasing order by default you can change that order when you construct that map yeah so this facility is also there so many people don't know this also and prerequisite of this video is obviously you should have at least seen map and unordered map in c++ code here and there so that you will be able to understand what i'm talking here but if you use unordered map for this same purpose and let's suppose you insert in any order, I don't know, maybe first this guy, then this guy, and then this guy, you don't know in what order you may get when you loop over that another map because it is not having any order. No ordering is involved in this, but what you can be sure of that it will have only one key of this kind, like one and two and three. So if you want to just map two things, you don't care about the orders, then you should go for an order map. But if you want to map the uh, key and value pair, meaning if you want to have association, but you want order when you access them, then you need an order. Then in that case, you should go for map. Okay. So this was your first point. Second point is implementation. Yeah. So you should know like map is implemented using red black tree. That's what community or some stack overflow you will see people are saying that okay this is red black tree but i don't think community have actually disclosed that what tree they are using but it best matches with the red black tree because it has uh, best complexity it doesn't rotate much i mean it's not like an avl avl have so much of uh, balancing property avl cannot handle even single disbalance but this can do and avl is like the best balanced binary search tree but red black is like uh -huh, it gives a little bit of space that's why its complexity is also not that bad and the result is also balanced with good extent so that's the reason people guess that okay they should have used red black tree whereas in unordered map they use hash table i'm not going to explain what hash table is maybe in some another video Oh my God, I have not given any video for hash table, right? So maybe next video can be a hash table video. I, I do remember I have a red black tree video, but I don't have a hash table video, I guess. Then I should give that video also. Yeah, so hash table is coming up next. So don't worry about that. So this was two points. Third point is search time. This is really very important. You should consider this when you use map or another map. Log n. And if you don't want any order, then you should go for unordered map because see, look at the complexity of accessing the data. Isn't it so fast? Yes, it is. So the average is order of one. Worst case is obviously order of n, but you can be assured that this is not going to hit it. 
so the comparison i mean to have a comparison if you don't want any order go for this if you want orders in your key and value then you go for this that's it there's no any difference because if you need order this guy is not going to give you order okay then you have to sort it and it's just a waste so why not go for map if you need order and if you don't need order then don't pay that extra cost of inserting and every time when you insert you have to balance that red black red black tree and at least you have to traverse that tree and decide like where i have to fit and all that so it's very clear fourth point is insertion time see it is log n like you have to traverse right here and there and once you insert because it is tree so if you have tree then you have to traverse right and then you have to decide okay if i have to push something then you have to traverse and that is going to take log n plus rebalancing because the moment you put something in this tree it is possible that it would get unbalanced then you have to rebalance it so that the size of this tree won't grow in a linear fashion so that it will be balanced so it will make sense to use tree so this is log n plus rebalance this is like same as search see it takes average order of 1 see this is really great right and see deletion time is also the same thing you have to go and traverse till that node and let's suppose you are deleting this then you have to put this guy here or this guy here and then rebalance because there can be millions of nodes so this could be a tricky part whereas this is like piece of cake it's just order of 1 so you see this this is like a great deal right so order of 1 order of 1 order of 1 and this portion is like you do all the time with the data structure right like you search the item you insert the item you delete the item so what do you want you just need these things right so the only distinguish factor is you should use map i'm telling you again <laughs> like if it is required that you need data for sure that it should be sorted then go for map and if you want just the mapping like key value pair you don't care about the order use this so next video is going to be maybe on a hash table or what is the difference between storing data in tree or hash table like there must be some advantage using this right i may come up with any of the video so stay tuned i'll see you in the next videos bye bye take care